Hello, I am Stephen Hawking. I am an intellectual seeker of knowledge and comprehension. I have an IQ higher than you can count. I am going to be playing Fallout. New Vegas. Playing this game will provide perception on human creative obsessions with post-apocalyptic survivalism. With my high IQ, knowledge of science and advanced upper-level thought, I am sure I will not fail. Bitches. Okay, let's enjoy the introduction. changes. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business, under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier. I am Stephen I am Hawking, the courier. Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. Let me show you my package. What oh, seemed oh, oh. like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink. Dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. The constant casino and gambling references are annoying and unnecessary. I get it. We are in Las Vegas. To fucks. Let's just get on with the game. In this game, I will be playing myself. Apparently a stupid courier, but also a seeker of all things scientific and progressive. I will explore the lands where signs of technology and advancement. And the effects of post-apocalyptic influence on society. Okay bitches, let's get started. You're awake. How about that? Whoa, easy there, easy. 
You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. Damage? Your name? Have you seen me lately? Can you tell me your name? I can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. Ha ha ha, hoo hoo. Dumb. To Good Springs. Now, I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the... No problem, Doc. Out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? This is how I perceive myself in a post-apocalyptic environment. As if I just went through chemotherapy. Let's move on. Well, I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. Ooh, looking good so far. Go ahead and give the bigger tester a try. We'll learn right quick if you get back all your faculties. Okay, of course I'm going to put all my abilities in intellect and perception. With my remaining points I will add them to luck and charisma. I don't plan on having much use for any strength or endurance. My big throbbing brain tool will supersede the need for such primitive human characteristics. There we go. That looks good. Let's move on. Look at that. Maybe them bullets done your brain some good. Well, we know your vitals are good. But that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in a bighorn or dropping. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? See if your dogs are still barking. Let's see if my dogs are still barking. Whatever. That's dumb. All right. I'm going to say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes Cock. to mind. Dog. House. Kick. Night. Cocky cat with a side of cock. Bandit. Your mom's cock. Light. Lots of cock. Mother. Loves the cock. Okay. Now I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. First one. Conflict just ain't in my nature. I agree. That you love the cack. Ha ha. I am given to rely ha. on others for support. Whatever. 
I'm sick of this. I'm always Let's move on. The center of attention. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. No fucking way. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. No fucking way. We're almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Splooge. On your mom's back. How long is this going to take? Okay. How about this one? Last one. Let's hope so. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. Yes, See let's look at the results. Idea. In the next episode, bitches.